All right, we are here with Kurt. He is a, what is your title? I'm a stitcher. He is a stitcher, and you are handling this pursuit thong. What's, what's the issue here? We are going to give you an alteration, and we're going to take two inches out of the back strap and uh, give you a better fit. All right, so you guys, you've seen me wear Pursuit a lot. I really love this brand. The colors are great. It just didn't quite fit me right, and I want to give them a chance. So instead of just doing away with it, we are going to improve alter it. Alter it. Alter it, alter it. How hard of a job is this for you? It's pretty intense. I mean, I'm going to take the seam apart. I need to open the seams, uh, remove part of the elastic, and it's kind of basically what I'm doing on this one where I'm releasing the strap from the crotch and so I've opened up the sides and the elastic in here and um, what I'll be doing is taking out from this piece so because of your height you know we're going to give you a shorter stature and we're going to put that in and cut the excess out and then rejoin it clean up and put the elastic and right there. And for the most part, I'll do a good job, but no one else is going to see it. It's yeah, right. We're at the placement. So designers, it would be great if you had a place for us shrug guys to include our height. Like you do ask height, right? Yes. Yes. Yeah. Because, um, how a piece like this would fit on someone of my height, that's like five foot five versus someone that's six feet plus. It's just a different amount of fabric. Um, yeah, so between altering versus making your own pieces, what is your preference? I like to do custom and um, fit you. Um, what you bought is very good quality. Uh, everybody's different. Uh, everybody's different size front, different size in the back, and you know that's why I do custom. All right, so maybe we start with alterations, and if I wanted to do a custom piece, how would we start? Do you present the fabrics to me, or I say what I like, or how does it work? It's really up to you. I can get the fabric. You are welcome to choose from what I have. Um, sure. Do you have a, a, um, a little portfolio of fabrics, or how do I choose? Right now, <laughs> that's the fabrics. And then I've got drawers up there. Drawers in here. So for me, I am a swimsuit guy, and would you say these fabrics are more underwear or swimwear, or both? I work? mostly have swim. I mostly have swim, not so much on the underwear. I've had clients send me fabrics that they like and prefer, and um, I'm willing to work with anything. And um, everybody's cut different, so I can vary from a very small pouch to a very large pouch. Um, it's just what you are comfortable wearing, and yeah, so if you were to show me a few fabrics, so I like, I like neon colors, I like solids more than patterns, um, is there... I've got some solids right there. Oh, nice. I've got lime green up there, the blacks are there, the purples are in there, uh, metallics here. Oh, metallics, I, metallics are pretty cool. So, it's just a matter of, you tell me what your favorite color is. Wow, it's like a... It's like a candy shop in here. I literally can have anything. How about liners? Because liner is a big thing for me. A lot of guys don't like lining. Um, there are some that really want to hang. So I, I do put linings in if you prefer them. If you don't like linings, I don't put linings in. So for me, the lining issue, it's more so because I don't want the transparency. Maybe right. there's another way around it with nope, the different... Nope, there are some guys that... Yes, uh, I have dropped... A guy has sent me a white swimsuit that had no lining, and like you say, transparency is an issue. So I took the whole suit apart because it was a favorite of his, and I dropped in a lining. Um, it's not a problem because while I had it apart, I made the pattern for him, and now I'm making him custom suits from that pattern. Um, show me this. I did see this on your site, your page, this little jewel thing. Okay, these are new ones that I just got in. I'm not exactly happy with the quality of these because there is nothing on the back um, like these. So for those that don't know what this is, this is like the little embellishment that goes on the, the cross. This seat. does, and yeah. I need to order more. But this one has got um, reinforcement. There's like chain on the back that 
you know, is reinforced and it's sturdy. These I got off of Amazon and I'm a little scared to use them, but I think what I'll do when I do use these is put the fabric still behind it so that the fabric will strengthen it and it'll just be bling to see. This is like on the waist, the side. These are sides. Fashion, you? Do you wear your own creations? <laughs> <laughs> yes, at 56, I am still wearing my own thongs and stuff. Uh, my husband is 64 and hasn't had to buy underwear in the last 22 years. What an amazing skill to have. Well, anyways, Kurt, thank you so much for your time. I'm really excited to see the alterations and work with you in the future. And we're, I can't believe we're pretty much neighbors. <laughs> okay, take care.